Hey there, Internet Self May here. I've got essentially another mail opening video for you, um, but a little backstory to this one. I do run a crocheted business on Etsy, and I decided to sign up for my first craft fair this year. Uh, it's not till the end of next month, which is both forever away and tomorrow at the same time. But the reason that's even important is because I decided to order new uh, business cards because the ones that I had were ones that I printed and did at home and they weren't super great. So I decided to go online and design some new ones and I tested out like three different sites and ended up going with Zazzle, which I had heard of a long time ago as a selling platform but didn't know that they did business cards and the like. So I was kind of surprised that that was the site that I really liked. But I've got, I believe this one will be business cards and this little tiny wooden mailer should be the postcards that I ordered that have a little blurb about, you know, what Zilfmay means and how it relates to the business. And then I was going to be writing down coupon codes on these and giving them to people who make a purchase so that they are enticed to make another purchase. So let's get cracking. I do like that these guys came in a cardboard mailer. I don't know why, but that makes me happy. It's just nice to hold. Packing slip, blah, blah, blah. Okay, and I'm interested to see how these went, how these turned out because um, the way that they're typically set up is to be this way. So I had to do one, like set it sideways so that it's this way. So that the front and the back would have the same alignment, if you will but it looks pretty nice. So this is the front of the postcard. Oh man, it's so bright in here. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. I'll take it out of the packaging so it won't be shiny. But I made it so that one side of this postcard is going to, oh, you can barely see the purple, that's a bummer. But here is the card. It's got like a rainbow kind of pastel color going on. There we go. And then some geometric shapes. It says the shop name, which is Zilfmay Creations. And then beauty is in the little yarn things. That's some really nice thick cardstock. And then the back, it looks a little bit smaller than I thought it would. But the back just kind of looks where it's got the little blurb on there. And then it's got my social media tags. It was supposed to be purple on the back, but it looks like it printed in black and white. I must have forgot to tick that or something. Overall, I'm kind of happy with how those went. I think I think I ordered like 20 some. Does it say? Packing slip 24. Which I guess is some pessimism in terms of what I am expecting for sales, but I didn't think I would need as many of those as I would the business cards because business cards I'll use more long term. Let's see if I can get into this. Uh, oh dear lord, they're just everywhere. Ooh, they tried to make it packaged nice. So I just got the standard hundred card set, the lowest setting they give you. Oh hey, fifty percent off cards and invites. That's nice. I got two of those. Um, so they were originally in a box, but somewhere in the postage, they are no longer in the box. But the reason they're in a box is because I got little squares. And you still can't see that. But it's just got my logo on one side with that pattern on it. And then the back just says Zilfmay Creations. I believe it says view our inventory on Etsy and then has my social tags on it. I wanted to keep them clean and simple so that people just, you know, you get the card, it stands out, and it's pretty straightforward. They're also on pretty nice cardstock. I like, I really love that they're squares. I don't know why it matters, but it looks really nice with my circular logo. So it fits nice. Well, I'm going to play around with those because there's 
a bunch that fell out of the box, and I'm going to straighten those out. But um, that's pretty much what I got in the mail and what's going on with me. I'm hoping these work really well for my craft show. I'm hoping that goes well. It's like an hour outside of town, so I'm not sure a lot of people I know will end up going. But it should be really cool to get to sell in person. Um, and that's pretty much it. I am waiting on two... I think they're 8x8 or 8x10 posters that just have, like, my logo and the shop name on it that are supposed to be like, hey, that's the name of this booth you're standing in. Um, I'm not sure why they didn't show up with the rest of this since I ordered them all at the same time, but we'll find out. Thanks for dropping by to watch me open some more mail. I'll see you guys next time.